Here is the easiest and quickest way I found to update ArcOS on your R36S handheld console. It can also work on some other compatible ArcOS based handhelds. The only two things you need for that is an Android smartphone which supports USB tethering and an USB-C OTG cable like the one I'm holding right here. First, make sure that you have access to stable and relatively fast Wi-Fi connection. You don't want it to randomly disconnect during the update. Second, ensure that your console is charged up to at least 60% battery level. Now connect one end of the cable into the OTG port on your console and the other end into your smartphone. Once you've done that, the only thing that's left to do is to enable USB tethering on your mobile device. You can find the option somewhere in your system settings. Before you proceed, make sure that your smartphone is connected either to a Wi-Fi network or to a mobile network so that it will be able to share the network connection over the cable to your console. Now navigate to the settings menu and select the update option. After a short while, you should see a screen with a warning. All that this tells you is if for whatever reason the update process gets interrupted halfway through, you risk damaging your system files and breaking your device. If you want to be 100% sure that everything goes smoothly, I strongly advise you to make a backup of your system SD card before doing the update. If you're sure you want to continue, on the next screen you'll be asked to type in OK using the console buttons, and then the update will start. In my case, it took around 15 minutes, but this can vary depending on the network connection quality and speed. Once the update finishes, you'll be prompted to restart your device. And that's pretty much it. The whole process is done. As I've already mentioned, this can also work on some other ArcOS-based devices too, provided that they have a Wi-Fi module installed and they feature a working USB OTG port. Once the system restarts, you should be now on the latest version of the ArcOS. You can check that by trying to initiate the update process again. There are a few common errors you might encounter. First of them is not being connected to either Wi-Fi or mobile network on your smartphone. If that's the case, you'll see this message on the screen. Note that this message can also show if you're not using an OTG USB cable and you're using a regular USB cable instead. So yeah, I hope I was able to help you and until next time, bye!